politics, we always think that this is a place for people who are in their 40s or 50s. As long as you're passionate about it, as long as you have determination to serve the state and the people, then you can do it. I think every age is like a perfect age to be involved in politics. Let's all join hands and work for the betterment, the development of the state. In politics, we always think that this is a place for people who are in their 40s or 50s and or maybe uh, 60s and above. But now, uh, with this victory, with this triumph, I believe that uh, no matter how young or old you are, as long as you're passionate about it, as long as you have determination to serve the state and the people, then you can do it. So I think every age is like a perfect age to be involved in politics. Uh, you have been working in the eyes of municipal corporation. Do you think it will be beneficial for you to have a mayor municipal uh, Definitely, yes, yes. Yes, definitely. I, I, I'm going to keep it short, sorry. So, so uh, as Well, there are a lot of uh, things to say and things to be done. So um, I have uh, a whole lot of strategy out here, but then I'm sorry I couldn't bring it out right now. But um, I just wanted to, you know, tell them and to let them know, to let all the female know that uh, we're, you know, even if we're um, girl or female, it, it doesn't mean that this has to stop us from doing something that we like and we are passionate about. So I would like to encourage and also I would like to tell, uh, send a message to all the female in any community and society that if you want to go for it then you can go for it so uh, let's all you know like but we have to have the passion and we have to you know like have the dream about it and then it's just it's possible anything is possible um this this victory is uh, is not a victory of us or the candidate or the party. This is the victory of the people, the people who want to change, the people who want to bring more development. So this victory is dedicated to all the people who have casted their vote for us. What's your message for the Mizoram people, for women and girls especially? Oh, well, um, I would just like to say that let's all join hands and work for the betterment, the development of the state, not any personal favor, no nepotism, no corruption. Let's just do things uh, the way it's supposed to be. Let's just uh, be honest and uh, be righteous in whatever we're doing. And I hope God will bless us abundantly.